Hey guys, Justin with our useful yard. I want to show you something cool that we did that you might like to. If you have a chicken hoop coop, if you have a moat. So we already showed you our omelet automatic chicken door opens and closes with the sunshine. And it's great. They come out here on this side of the moat. Well, they have killed all of the grass. It's all dirt now. And we need to get some seeds down out here because it's almost time to start planting. And we don't want them in the garden where our plants are. So this is the solution we came up with. We were trying to encourage them to go all the way around the moat, but they get over here and then last night we probably had a dozen chickens that didn't know where to go. They just knew that this was home. We've got another omelet automatic chicken door that's programmed with the sun, again, just like the other side. But now what we can do is we can turn that other side off and put down grass seed, let everything come back to life while they work on this end of the moat. And then we can flip flop. So. Hopefully we'll always have fresh grass for the chickens to go out and scratch on. So maybe not the best option for everybody, hundred different kinds of chicken coops out there. This is what we found has worked the best for us. We can have our garden in the middle and our moat of chickens going around. The only other thing that we're still figuring out and working on for the moat is protection from aerial predators. Over here, we put our tomato cages down on the sides so they can run through them back and forth, but The best option that we've had so far for keeping them safe from the hawk, and I think it's the cheapest solution too. So I just took a short piece of fence and I left the, um, I don't know what you call it, if I cut it, I left the legs on it and stuck the legs into the ground and now you see right there, they're going, running right under it and we've got a bunch of them spread all through the moat so as they're scratching as they're foraging as they're doing their their best chicken life they're always under some fencing we haven't lost a single chicken to the hawks since we put the stuff out here that tells me it's working i don't know maybe somebody has a better idea so we came up with the idea for the chicken moat from living traditions homestead i don't know how many other homesteads, families, farmers are doing chicken moats out there. It's the best option that we've had yet. We've had the tractor supply, little cheap ones. We had a shed turned into a chicken coop and this is what we settle on. We've been the most happy with it. Maybe it works for you. The double door with keeping them on fresh grass, I think is gonna be a big win. Thanks for watching.